Hi there, Craig. It's Corey here from West Point Autos. Just doing a quick video tour on our 2011 Honda Accord Euro. Um, so in the video tour, I'll quickly go around the outside of the car, show you any dental scratches that it may have, also running through the interior condition and the service history. Okay, so first off, we'll start with the, the front of the car. Um, it's pretty neat through here. A uh, few slight stone chips in the paint, just around there. As you can see, the bonnet's pretty clean. Dirt just there. See no dental scratches on there. Just a reflection of the Coming around to the front, so grills in all good condition there. Um, one of the marks I could see was just on this fender just here. So it's had, still had a bit of a scrape just there. That's probably the only major damage. It is pretty hard to see from afar, as you can see. Just along that kind of crease. I'll continue on the other, down this side. So like I said, other than that, there is no other damage on this side. You can see no dents or scratches. It does already have its tinted windows as well, which is good. Wheels are in good condition, not gutter rushed, which is nice. Around to the back, back where we were. Again, pretty good condition back here. Uh, the other mark I did notice, it is really hard to see. Just here, there's a few little scratches, there's a small chip. Someone's rubbed against it. But yeah, there's this, a bit of a, a mark just there. You can see that on camera. Again, very minimal, hard to see from a distance if you're not looking for it. And just do the other side for you. That one's a little bit scratched up just on the top there. Come around this side. Yeah, no dents or scratches along those doors. And then these wheels are in pretty good condition also. Just a little bit down there. Okay, so that is the exterior of the car. If we have a look at the interior. There's the door car in pretty good condition. Small mark there, just rubs off. There we go. Bring it around to the other side. Same again, door cards are all nice and tidy. And the interior is pretty neat too. There's a small mark on the seat just there. Other than that, that's about it. Um, that, that can just get wet backed out as well. That'll get that mark off. You can see, in pretty good condition. Bolsters aren't wear, worn or torn. No rips, which is good to see. So we'll come around to the front now. Again, this driver door, you've got your electric mirrors there, your electric windows, your locking as well, and then also you've got your um, boot release there too. Okay, we'll quickly have a look at the service history of the car. Okay, so first we'll just have a look at the owner. So the previous owner was. Summit Auto Leasing, Australia. Uh, looks like they're located at the Brisbane Airport. I don't know if that's a lease car or not. Okay, so that's the previous owner. Uh, being a company car, I imagine it's got very good service history. So it looks like the services were done at Sunshine Coast Honda. So the first one was done at 10,000 Ks. Next one was done at 20,000 Ks. That's actually early. That they've done that. No, late, sorry. So that's uh, 10,000 six months. Did that at 20. Same again at Sunshine Coast, Honda. Next 20,001 was done at 21,000, so they caught up there. Again, Sunshine Coast, Honda. The 30,000 kilometer one done at 32,000 case at Sunshine Coast, Honda. 
and the 40,000 K one was done at here at West Point Autos at 41,000 Ks and that will be all the services yep so it's got all of its service history a few of them were a little bit late there and it's also got all its um, books and documents so it's just there in a little fold up case so they have all the manuals there pop that into the glove box okay so this is the interior condition through here at the front Bring through there, so all that polished metal look is all in pretty good tact, no wearing or tearing on there. The rear passenger seat looks pretty good as well. Okay, now for the um, actual car itself. Okay, so we've got our speedometer and our tacker up there. Our steering wheel, we've got our cruise control there. That's operation of the screen, that screen in the middle. Control's just there. And then you've got your radio controls there. And then as you can see, you've got your minus and your plus paddles there for your paddle shift. This car does have. Um, okay, now onto your radio. So that's your screen up there, which will light up with all your um, radio stations. As you can see here, you've got your volume, different selecting for there. Then you've got your air, co air conditioning below that. Um, you've also got a few little slots that pop up and down here. You've got a 12 watt port in there and an ashtray. So they all click away. Nice and neat there. Um, this car also comes with two remote locking keys. One hasn't even been used. Um, and then you've got your cup holders there and that folds away. It's comes really nice and tidy through to there. And then isn't this little compartment, I don't know if you can see it, the lighting's not great. Um, you've also got another 12 volt port and an AUX port in there. And that's in pretty good condition as well, that bolster. Okay, I'll give it a quick turn on for you. So there we go. Everything's on, it's just letting me know my door's open, I don't have my seatbelt on and the handbrake's on. Yeah, it starts first time, idles nicely. You can see there's your radio control up there. So yeah, Craig, that is your Honda Accord Euro 2011 model. So I hope this video too has helped to kind of let you know what kind of condition the car's in, what it looks like you know, in real life rather than just through pictures. So that is the car there. Um, like I said to you on the phone, um, if you are interested in this car, um, you can put a holding deposit on it. Um, again, I've given your number to our finance department. Um, if they haven't already contacted you already, um, they should be contacting you in the next few days. Um, so yeah, with that, um, if you want to let me know when Chris is coming down to view the car, and then we can con continue on from there. So thanks a lot for watching, Craig. Um, I hope this video has been helpful. Thank you. Bye.